Hey guys, so what's up? It's Addie here. Welcome to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing another haul for you guys because I just spent a good four to five hours in the Vesoria today. I was just there earlier and I have to tell you, I miss going to the Vesoria. It was so much fun. I cannot believe I haven't been there in months, which is pretty sad. <laughs> I took quite a while shopping in the Vesoria earlier, so I ended up getting a bunch of random stuff and I just can't wait to show you guys all the stuff I got. But before we get into the haul, I just want to invite each and every one of you to subscribe to my channel by clicking the subscribe button down here. That's right, you guys. Just click that subscribe button and you will be alerted on all of my videos. Let the Divisoria haul begin. You guys know I love my fur. Exhibit A. <laughs> so of course, I went out and I got for pillowcases. I got four pillowcases. Two are in gray and two are in white. And they're just so cute and furry and I love them. I actually wasn't even looking for fur pillows anymore because I'm trying to stop myself from buying fur. But for some reason in this haul, I just kept getting fur things. <laughs> it's 16 by 16 inches. I'm not sure if that's a standard size for a throw pillow, but these are the ones I got. So I got it in gray and I also got it in white. I decided to stick to neutral colors so that I can easily, you know, throw them around in my room. These fluffy furry pillowcases just cost me 45 pesos each. So all in all, I paid 180, but I actually haggled it down from 250 and then I managed to get it at 180 pesos which I think is a really good deal. You know the funny thing about these pillowcases? I didn't even find them in 168, which is where I normally go. I found them on the street. I was on the way to another street and then I just spotted these and then I realized, why don't I just buy this? <laughs> Since I got new pillowcases, I of course got new pillows. That's right, you guys. I got a bunch of throw pillows. This isn't even all of them. I got six. <laughs> I got these six throw pillows also from the street. They come in different designs, but of course I have pillowcases for all of them. They're just so soft. It's not the cheap type of pillow, if you know what I mean. It's really cut done and this is the type you can actually put in the washing machine to clean. I think this is a really good find. I got these two for two for 130. And I got these four for four for 250. So the more you buy, the cheaper it's gonna become. The reason why I bought this before this one was because I bought this first, and then after a while I realized, wait a second, I just bought pillowcases. Why didn't I buy pillows? <laughs> so I actually went back to the exact same store and then I bought four pillows for those four pillowcases. I got these spray paint cans. I got one in gold and I got one in black because there are a bunch of things in my room that I just want to spray paint. You know, a random picture frames or certain decor that I just don't like the color. So I'm going with black or gold because I feel like I have too much white. So I really, really had to stop myself from buying the white one. <laughs> so this one is 90 pesos and this one is 120 pesos. Don't ask me why, I don't know why the gold is more expensive, but yes, it is. I also bought this mask because I know that I'm gonna need it when I use the spray paint. This is just a typical black mask for this part of the face so that you know you don't inhale bad fumes, pollution, all that stuff. I got this for 20 pesos. This next one's kind of weird. So I got a water purifier for the faucet. Um, this is basically, okay, if you guys look closely, you just screw it onto the faucet and there's a bunch of rocks here that filter the water so it can become drinking water. Utilize non-woven filter to remove impurities like rust. Interesting. I just want to try this out and if you just drink from tap water, it saves you tons of money from actually ordering water from those filtering stations. So I got this one for 35 pesos. This is also kind of weird. Um, I bought these drain cover things. I don't know why, but for some reason, I keep losing the sink drain cover on my sink. I don't know. I honestly don't know what happened happens as it falls into the sink. So that's why I bought two this time so that in case one gets lost. These cost 10 pesos each. <laughs> There's another weird thing. So I got a spring form. This is actually for cooking or baking. To tell you the truth, I got this because I want to try making caviar pie and you need a spring form thing 
to make that and the reason for that is the spring form yes it has a spring <laughs> you just open it here and then you can remove the bottom yes now the bottom's gone oh my gosh I don't know how to put it back I'm so bad at this you guys oh my gosh what just happened you know what I have to practice using this yeah I've oh I did it! This is a 12 by 4.5 mini spring form and it cost me 120 pesos. Next up, I got two jars, a mini one and a kind of a bigger one. I got this one because I recently got into moisturizing with coconut oil and I find it really hard to, you know, keep doing that to the bottle and then putting it all over your body. So what I decided to do is to find a container where I could just dip my hand and then just put all over. Also, it lessens spillage, so that's why I got it. And this one one I got for the coffee scrub I'm gonna make so basically I'm gonna get coffee grounds and I'm gonna mix it with olive oil and that's gonna be my exfoliator so I chose the ones with the gold caps because you know I like gold so this one is 13 pesos and this one is 17 pesos <laughs> I don't know why I keep laughing at every item I got okay next up I have this trash can that's right, you guys. I bought this silver net looking trash can that's actually very sturdy. I literally walked all over the Vesoria with this on my arm and it just kept bumping everything and I'm very surprised that it is still in one piece. I'm also contemplating if I should keep it silver or if I should paint it gold. So if you guys have any suggestions, feel free to let me know in the comments down below. So I got this metal looking trash can for just 150 pesos. So I got two pairs of aviators. Ooh, you guys can see my ring light. Yeah, so I got two pairs of aviators. I got one in rose gold, and I got another one that's lined with silver, and it has a blue lens. I got both of these for 50 pesos each. Next up, I got me some jewelry. That's right, you guys. Check those out. I got these silver dangling earrings and this ear cuff. I really, really like the dangling effect of this one, and I just love ear cuffs. I actually already own ear cuffs that look like this but they broke so I just bought another one so I got this one for 50 pesos and this one is 30 pesos 80 peso jewelry not too bad <laughs> next up I got a bunch of seamless bras I got three actually so the first one is this black seamless bra and I just love how the back looks like the back is really crisscrossy and interesting so I just got this one I also got a nude one and it has a caged effect in the back which I really love and of course since I really really love the cage I got it in black <laughs> so it also has the cage thing at the back and if you guys look closely the material kind of looks like silk but it's like stretchy silk so it's it's a very very good feel Feeling fabric. I don't know. I think I buy stuff based on fabric also. I got these three for 250 pesos. They were originally 300 pesos because they were 100 each, but I managed to haggle it down to 250. The next thing I got is this rash guard. Yes, quote unquote Nike rash guard. Come on, people. We know it's not real. <laughs> but yes, I got this rash guard. I like that it's black and then it has hot pink details everywhere. I just wish that this wasn't here. I don't know if you guys noticed but I've become darker and that's because I recently went to Belair and I kind of got sunburned okay not kind of I really really got sunburned and it was only now that my face peeled off the rest of my body is still peeling but my face I think completely peeled off already so that's good I got a rash guard so the next time I surf I am protected <laughs> next up I got <laughs> Okay, this one's funny. Next up, I got a bunch of boxer briefs. This is a boxer brief, right? I'm not quite sure. It's not like I use them. I bought this for somebody. But yes, I got four boxer briefs. They're super cute. I'll show them one by one. So, of course, I got a basic black one, a basic blue one because that's his favorite color. And I also got a funny one. Check this out. It says, hot stuff. Hot stuff. <laughs> Which I think is really cute if a guy wears something like this. And of course, guys love comic books, so I got Spider Man. And it looks like an actual comic. Look at that. You can literally read comics off your underwear. I got these for 50 pesos each, so all in all, I paid 200 pesos. This next one is also not for me because it, it's really big. I got socks. This is a dozen pairs of black socks because this person just 
goes through socks, like it's tissues. I decided to just buy him a dozen pairs of black socks. I mean, you can't go wrong with black. This is 180 pesos for 12 pairs of socks. And it's actually a really good material also. It's a nice thick material. It has a good garter on it. These will last very long. <laughs> the next thing I want to show you guys are these cute slip- are these slip-ons? I'm not sure what to call them. I got these cute slip-ons. They have Baymax on it. I bought them because I am gonna do a project with these. I'm gonna be doing a DIY tutorial for you guys. So that is why I bought these. Well, mainly because they're basic black. So it's gonna be quite easy to turn them into something else. But Baymax is so cute. I'm just gonna be sad that I have to cover up Baymax. I got this pair of cute Baymax slip-ons for just 200 pesos. My best find today. Check out this fur. <laughs> That's right you guys. I bought more fur. I just I just can't stop buying. So I got black fur and white fur. I mean, look at this you guys. It's so cute. And the reason I got this is because I'm going to add fur to the slip-ons I just showed you. I'm going to be doing a DIY project where I'm going to cover Baymax with this black fur and I'm also going to experiment with this white fur. I'm going to try to make it into something. So basically, I got half a yard, half a yard, which equals one yard. I just paid 395 for this. I really just bought it so I could play around with the fur and see what else I can cover up with fur. Next up, I got this mini air humidifier. Basically, it cleans the air and makes the air smell good. So let's check out the one I got. So I got it in blue. So cute. It looks like a teardrop. It even comes with a free scent. So I got this one for 300 pesos. Next up is this white box. Let me just open it up so you can see. So I got a fidget cube. If you guys don't know what a fidget cube is, it's basically this thing that you can give to people who just can't stop moving, like they just can't stop doing stuff with their hands, like biting their nails. I got this fidget cube to keep my hands busy. Each side has some random thing you can do. This one can turn. This one just, just has buttons you can just click. It does nothing, but you can just click it. Yeah, and this one you can click. You can click this. It's just a bunch of random things you can do, all packed into this tiny little cube. This one just costs 150 pesos. Next up, I got this case for a Kindle. This is also a gift. <laughs> I do not own a Kindle. I actually don't even read a lot. I got this cool looking case. He's a guy, so he would really appreciate these nice curvy lines. And it's super thick. If you guys see, it's super thick material. Anyway, so I got this soon to be Kindle case for 100 pesos. It was actually originally 180 pesos, but I managed to haggle it down to 100 pesos. Last but not least, I got this ocean pack. It's literally a backpack you can use in the ocean. So I will show you guys what's in here. Of course, I got it in black because you can't go wrong with black. So this is how the back looks like and this is how the front looks like. It's really big. Anyway, so it also comes with this. It's the strap. You attach the strap here and down here. The cool thing about this bag is that it's waterproof and you know, you can carry it around and everything. It's super light. You basically just fold it three times. Well, that's what it says, but I'm gonna fold it more times. And then you just take these together and snap. And voila, it is now a waterproof bag. I got this 20 liter ocean pack for just 250 pesos. And those were everything I got from Divisoria today. I know that in my last Divisoria haul video, I put together all of the stall numbers for you guys and the malls, but for this one, I kind of forgot to do it. I'm so sorry. And I didn't expect to buy this much, so I didn't get to do it. But I can tell you guys that I got every single thing from the 168 mall, except for the furry pillowcases and the pillows which I got on the streets. And that's it for all of the stuff I got from Divisoria earlier. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you guys like the stuff I got. I know it's super random, like there's no theme at all for all the stuff I bought today, but I'm super excited to try each and every one of them. If you guys like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, feel free to click the subscribe button down below. It's that big red button that says subscribe. And if you guys have any questions, comments, suggestions, <laughs> please want to talk to me, feel free to leave me a comment down below. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Bye!